Hi everyone, this is Steve Johnson and welcome to another three minute thriller where we give you professional development in three minutes or less. In this three minute thriller, we're going to talk about Clever. We're going to talk about Clever integration and how Clever can help make your classroom run a lot more smoothly with technology. So as you may have noticed when students open up their Ubermix laptops, a new tab opens up now um, for Clever. And, and the URL that uh, or website that, that it opens up to is this one right here. So this website right here is um, where students and teachers can go in order to access Clever. What does Clever do? Well, Clever makes it really easy to sign in to different applications. As a matter of fact, it, it makes it easy to have a single sign-on for MobiMax, Typing.com, Code Academy, and many more. So again, you want to go to this website right here and um, click Enter. And again, on the students' web uh, uh, computers, this tab will open up. Now, if they haven't already logged in with Google into the browser, they can do so here. So they click Log in with Google after going to the Clever website for our district. And I'm going to put my daughter's name in. She's a student in, uh, in the district. And I need to put a password in. Okay, now when students first log in, they might have to accept an agreement and click a button and then maybe even accept another one. But then after that, this is what will always happen when they log in. Now my daughter, since she goes to a school that has MobiMax, she has a single sign-on for MobiMax. So if I click on this, it will go to her MobiMax account. For CK12, many science teachers and junior high are using this. If she clicks on this, she gets logged in automatically to a CK12 account. Same thing with Code Academy, Formative, Code Academy, Code.org, and Typing.com. And there are many more applications we may end up adding uh, as the year or the years go on. Now below here where it says links, these aren't single sign-on. So up here, if, if she was to click on one of these, she would be logged in automatically to that application. Down here though under links, these are just links. All right. So if she's signed into Google Drive, she'll be able to get into Google Drive, Google Classroom, Google Mail, and Google Calendar just fine. But these right here, Renaissance Place, she still has to put in her Renaissance Place username and password. Same thing with Lexia Core 5. This is just a link, this is just a link, and this is just a link. So Clever basically connects our student information to these applications to make logging in even easier. If you have any questions, please let me know, and hopefully this was helpful.